everything is checked. So let's go. Hey guys, so today I'm going to Cape of Good Hope. Come with me and uh, I brought my jacket with me because it's going to be so windy there. So come with me. So guys, I'll tell you um, some few tips about the trip to Cape of Good Hope, yeah? Uh, if you're driving from the CBD, the drive will take you approximately uh, an hour, 20 minutes, since it's about 70 kilometers away. So we decided to hire a driver for the day and uh, that costed us a little bit um, above a thousand. That was about a thousand eight hundred rand. So you can do your calculation, USD, euros, whatever currency you prefer. Um, so now I'll tell you a little bit about uh, Cape of Good Hope. This is a rocky headland on the Atlantic coast of the Cape of Peninsula in South Africa. Yeah? And a common misconception is that the Cape of Good Hope is the southern tip of Africa, which is based on the misbelief that uh, the Cape was uh, the dividing point between the Atlantic and the Indian Ocean. In fact, the southernmost point of Africa is Cape Agulhas, which is about 150 kilometers east southeast. Yeah? The currents of the two oceans meet at the point where the warm water, which is the Agulhas current, meets the cold water, uh, the Benguela currents, and turns back on itself. I mean, this is a thing that you could not see with your eyes, but it's a, it's a scientific thing that has been already, um, uh, you know, discovered, right? So guys, as promised, we're here. Cape of Good Hope, a lot of people, and uh, it's quite windy, so I had to bring my coat, otherwise, I'm gonna fall sick. So, that's not the point, is it? Not? <laughs> so, there is actually a stretch going all the way up to that little hill, and um, I believe there is a beautiful love day, but uh, beautiful view. I mean, however, I don't think I'm gonna go up there <laughs> because I don't have the strength of legs. So that is the cape point. I'm gonna take a photo and the video right there in a while. But my goodness, the weather just behaved. <laughs> Yesterday was so cold, but today is just the right time. And it's about, uh, let's see, it's about uh, 10, uh, 11 o'clock. So it's uh, nice weather so far. Yeah. As you can see, everyone is fighting for this position. And as I said, there is a stretch going all the way out. So if you have strength, you can do it. For me, not today. <laughs> yep. So guys, I may be uh, tired by now, <laughs> not true to my words, I had to go up the hill and I'm literally losing breath. So let's hope it's going to be a beautiful view up here and uh, enjoy while we can. Yeah, let's see the view yeah, from behind. Up. <laughs> yes, that is still a nice view. Okay, let's keep going. There are some points that are really chilly, so I have to put on my coat at some point. Guys, man, I need a trophy for this. 
Yes, just check it out. Oh no, I was higher than this, all the way up top. There is a taller mountain or hill right behind that zone. Don't be cool. Yes, this is so beautiful. See how many people and cars are here. All the tourists come. You must make sure you come here once you're in Cape Town. The Cape of Good Hope. And there is another one, Cape, Cape Point, which we will be going later. But uh, this is one of the tips of the continent. Mamma mia! What a view! Look at all the seaweed. So unfortunate. But look at that! My goodness! It's so unfortunate all this sewers here, but I'm sure the government is doing something about it. But look at that view, yo! As I said, I wish I could bring my swimsuit and just, you know, enjoy. However, it's literally impossible. So yeah, let's go. So let's see whether you guys are gonna see that. But these are the fields. They're sunbathing. <laughs> yeah. There is a restaurant out here. I think we're gonna go there later. But, uh, yeah. This is the Cape Point. Okay, guys. As promised, now I'm at the Cape Point, as you can see. So there is a funicular that goes all the way up top. I'm gonna take you guys with me, but uh, be patient. We're almost there. guys are coming up from up top there is a lighthouse there it's exactly where I'll be going yes so let's go okay lighthouse here we come the view keeps getting better and better I'm already here and this is the lighthouse the view from up top Mamma Mia Not go all the way down, man. It's so, so far, but it, the sea is very calm.
Okay guys, I'll tell you how much we spent out there, yeah? There's an entrance fee to the Cape of Good Hope pack, which is about 376 rand for tourist adults, yeah? And 94 rand for South African nationals. Sadly, we had to pay for our driver. I mean, he was local. I didn't see the point of him to pay and he was there as a driver, not as a tourist. Anyway, there's no exception. <laughs> Yeah, the Cape of uh, Point Funicular tickets were around 85 rand for a return ticket and 75 rand for one way. I mean, there's no point to pay one way and it's only a difference of 10 rand. So we certainly took a return ticket. And uh, it was a spectacular trip, worth every dime. And I'd urge you guys to make the trip as well, yeah? Uh, that is it for now. And uh, I cannot thank you guys enough for staying tuned. To this video i hope you all get a chance to visit soon and please remember to share this video and don't forget to subscribe please guys yeah until next time keep it locked ciao